bad unprofessional doctor is unacceptable because that could cause to that could cause to illness or even death. But for the job of a programmer, you don't have to be so professional. And today you will see that that's wrong and how destructive a programming mistake could be. I decided to make this video after I wasted hours to fix a mistake in my program. It was basically a sneaker store where you could buy sneakers. And when I, like the customer, bought put things in my cart, it you it calculated the money incorrectly. And the reason why was because in some of the shoe in, because in some of the shoe variables the the number was at, not like a number but a string. This was just for fun, luckily, but what if the same problem happened on Amazon or eBay? Can't you believe how much money they would lose? So watch this video so your programs are never going to be so destructive. Heathrow Terminal 5 opening. In Heathrow Airport, people made a new lug luggage handling system, and they tested it a lot of times until the opening day. But at the first day of work, everything went crazy. And in the next 10 days, at least 42,000 pieces of luggage couldn't, couldn't fly with their owners. And more than 500 flights were canceled. And it was all because the people who programmed it forgot that a person could accidentally forget to put something in their luggage and then want to take it back from the strip. Another bug. On January 15, 1990, around 60,000 AT&T long distance customers tried to tried to get a call but got nothing. AT&T assumed it was being hacked, but later they understood that it was a bug in the software. And it was all because 114 long distance switches kept rebooting all the time. Are you ready for a big error? The explosion of the Arian 5. On June 4th, 1996, the unmanned an unmanned spacecraft, Arane 5, exploded after just 40 seconds of launch. It was the first voyage after a decade of development that cost $7 billion. And it turned out that the cause of the failure was a software error. In the software, a 64-bit floating number relating to the horizontal velocity of the rocket was converted into a 16-bit integer. Next huge crash. NASA's Mars Climate Orbiter. On its mission to Mars in 1998, the Mars Orbiter was ultimately lost in space. And later, they found out that a person who was writing the program for the Mars Orbiter made a simple conversion mistake. And instead of English use units, he accidentally used metric. Osprey aircraft crash. On a U.S. Marine Corps hybrid airplane and helicopter, a computer stopped the rotation of the engines, and, crew, and the crew of the airplane died. And probably one of the biggest mistakes that could cause the end of the world. On September 23rd, 1983, our planet was close to a nuclear war just because of a computer mistake, which could have happened between the US and the Soviet Union. There was a mistake where the alarm system uh, ac thought that the US launched nuclear missiles into the Soviet Union. But luckily, this didn't happen because the person double-checked the computer if the signal was correct. So subscribe to my channel and smash that like button and I hope your programs will not be so destructive from now on. Uh, let's go see how, how So let's go see how bad and destructive this is. Ready for a big error? It turned out that the cause of the error